Hello, everybody, and welcome. Oh, my goodness. What's happened? What's happened? Reno Construction Materials Plant. Oh, right, right, right. There's another brick. Dang it. There's another brick one. Um, there's the Pittsburgh Construction Materials Plant, and then there's one in Reno. But the problem isn't... The problem isn't making the bricks. The problem is not having enough gravel. Yes, so that one, that's one that's going to go out. But that's fine. And then this one up here is shutting down too. And that one just is going to start shutting down. Um, planks and steel. Don't really think, <coughs> excuse me, I hate coughing in your ear. I know I, I hate it. It's so unprofessional. I apologize. I was trying to hold it back as much as I could. I should have paused the video and taken a sip of water. Um, yeah, I guess that's fine. That stuff's just going to go away. And we'll roll the dice and we'll see if we can get something else. Um, but we were trying to get a couple of these cities up and running. Um, who was it? Was it Seattle? Yeah. So we got Seattle uh, squared away with an airline and a public transportation deal. And then I wanted to kind of marry up Seattle with Pittsburgh and I was really fretting it because I was like man I gotta I gotta rip this up and I gotta do this that and the other but I had an epiphany as soon as I logged off like two seconds after I logged off I had an epiphany why don't I just build another airport I have the money this can be the cargo airport right and even though it wouldn't be as efficient as having one major airport it's not that big a deal right so I'm going to do that. I'm going to build another airport and I'm going to build it someplace where there's tons of room for expansion. And I'm kind of thinking that it'll be right here. I'll make another road that just goes straight this way and I'll build the airport out that way. So that's what we're going to do right now. And hello. Thank you for joining me. Sorry that I immediately <laughs> was taken back with when the video started, but a lot of things happened that I did not anticipate. Is that clicked in? It is clicked in. Fantastic. Can I go ahead and just upgrade that to the faster road? Perfect. Lovely. Now here, passenger airport. Put it right in here. Just right up against that. Ooh. Perfect. And then if we ever need to, um, if we ever need to expand this out, it'll be easy. We'll just go do 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 right out through there. All right. And now we'll buy a couple of airplanes to go back and forth between Seattle and there. Let's start them over here in Pittsburgh. So we'll click on that, buy a vehicle, and we'll start off with. You just want to do a little Airbus? We'll just start off with a little Airbus right off the bat. We'll just buy one. We'll go from here all the way over to Seattle. Perfect. We'll call this <clears throat> airplane uh, fits the sea, and then uh, yeah, passenger. Da, 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 da. E N G E R. E N G. Oh, okay, cool. All right. Uh, so that's done, and now we need to get bus stops, rams, and bus stops. So of course we're gonna have one on the right hand side of the road, probably right there, and we'll probably click this road into this. So then the next one would probably be right around this corner, like right here. And maybe do a deep dive up there. Do another one that comes down this way. Then one last one before we leave, like right there. So we'll come up here to here, down into there, and then leave. Sounds pretty good to me. Uh, let's do a tram station. 
Put it out here, that'd look pretty cool, right? Cool, cool, and then we'll do tools, and we'll update all of this. Actually, we need to do streets first, and we need to connect that to that. And that to that. Lovely. Go back here, go to tools, the upgraded tram section. Good. I mean, it's good that they they give you like such small little little streets to upgrade, so it can really give you like fine detail and control over what you're you're doing. But it's also kind of annoying because <laughs> you have to click 500 million times. I'm just gonna do all of it because I don't I don't really know how this is gonna upgrade or like how the street or the city will change over time, and there might be a more efficient route that the that the um, trams can take and I, I want to make sure they have access to all of that okay and that looks like they do Ooh. over here to this click on that and we'll do the trams Pittsburgh is pretty big so we'll do six trams right off the bat I don't think we're gonna need that but eventually we will so there 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 and there and then this will be tram it's public transport. And there we go. We'll just unpause the game there. We'll set it up to move a little quick. I'll take a swig of water. Mmm. Delicious. And now Pittsburgh finally has joined the uh Oh look at that, they're already starting to upgrade. And I have to I have to imagine that's it because they have a an airport and trolleys. <laughs> Immediately things are getting better. All right. Or a tram system, not trolleys, rather. Okay, that's good. I love that. Um, and now we'll kind of do what we've always done. We'll kind of look at situations like this, and we'll kind of realize, like, hey, we need to have more trucks there. We need to have bigger trucks there. Um, kind of see what... Is it you guys? How many of you are you're all three right here together? I feel like we we, we just upgraded those. We're like we just Yeah. I feel like we just sent these three trucks out in the last video. So let's just let's just slow our roll for right quick. Are you even gonna get nineteen? Yeah, he did. Cool. Alright. Now yeah, we just slow our roll right quick on that front. Uh, but we are going to look for more things that are backed up. We do have a lot of food here that's not being transported. He's bringing in the fuel. What do we got? 737-700 and a 737-700C. So one of these is probably a cargo aircraft. Let's go look at the 7... Uh, and C probably stands for cargo, so 737C. Oh look, C cargo, C cargo. Seems like there's a D. Oops! I did not mean to click that button. Did I click it twice? Gosh darn it. Okay, it's this This was the... the, the okay, so this, this one held 53, loading speed of 6. This one only holds 20, loading speed of 3. So guess what we get to do? We get to spend $14 million to turn it back exactly to the plane that it was two seconds ago. That was fun. There we go. My goodness. We got tools here. Really? Are you the, are you the best we have right now for cargo? Oh, not really. It can be you, but that, that, that should be fine. Steel there. How are we doing down here on everything? Some tools here. You just pick up some? Yeah, you did. How many of you are there? There's quite a few. Okay. Quite a few. That's looking good. 
This is still kind of a hot mess. <clears throat> Excuse me. This is still kind of a hot mess over here with um, just just the amount of people that are waiting and the amount of people that get picked up. I mean, it's 125. That, that's quite a tall order. And what we could do is we could have a smaller train that just runs between here and Houston and then a smaller train from Houston to Reno. And they're just smaller trains that just go back and forth. Like that's It, it would be more like a metro than it would be like a, a long haul. And who knows, that might be the better play, the smarter play here. But this one right here holds like 150, and we always get almost 150, so it's kind of, it's kind of nice, really. Kind of nice. Uh, Fort Wayne Construction Materials Plant. That's great, Fort Wayne. We just don't have gravel. And that's the problem. We need more gravel. Here we got two guys. You're going are you dropping off? Yeah, he's dropping off planks. He's picking up though. So we can at least do this. We can at least make all these guys the red racers here. Oh, look at the deer, or uh, the stag, or an elk, or a red deer. I think they call it a deer. I think it's a red deer. And these are all the people who were dropped off. They're waiting, wandering. <laughs> They're all waiting patiently to be picked up via the trolley system. We just we just know that this takes a second, but they come in they come in so quick that it's not a big deal. All right, anybody else backed up? Oh, absolutely, one hundred percent backed up. Yes, sir. Do the big ones. Didn't even make a dent. Didn't even make a dent. out there to get more wood. Yeah, that one's a tanker. Eventually I think they're gonna have the ones with the stakes on the side, right? And those will be like the true logging trucks. Not these things. These are more for like boxes or finished goods. Like raw materials like this. I, I would see it on one of the stakes. Like there'd be a bunch of stakes back through here. Didn't even take any off the stack. Let's do another one. See how that goes. This one's going all the way to the sawmill over here, yeah. Don't we can there. That one right there looks pretty good. These are still the small oil trucks. And there's many of them. There's nine. Let's get rid of four of them. And then the other ones, let's turn those into these guys. Big oil trucks. Uh, that'll lower congestion and all that good stuff. Oh, cool. Look at Washershire. It's got this Doom Tower right here in the middle. That's pretty friggin' sweet. Good job, Worcestershire. Amazing. It's getting, I think, getting food, fuel, and tools. I think it's getting three of the four that it wants. And it has a airport. And a public transportation system, so. 
it's living its best life. Good job. Except for probably when a when a when a plane unloads, there's probably a bunch of people who get off. But maybe not. Maybe not. Maybe it's good. All the people who just got picked up. All right. Lovely. Oh, I feel like the trains have had. I'm having a, a problem with the trains. There's a lot, a lot of plastic here, and I just feel like they're not taking enough back with them. A lot of oil here, too. But this is the weird train. Like, this train has three different things that it holds on to, right? One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. It's a one-to-one -one ratio. So every time he drops off three tankerfuls of, of processed oil, he should be picking up three plastic. And where's that other train? It's just pulling out of the station. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six. This is the same one. Same way. I don't know why we're getting a residual over here. I don't know why we're getting a buildup. Don't know. Who is our most productive lines? Look at that. Negative 500, negative 500, negative 200. Wow. I didn't think we had so many negatives. Amazing. I never would have thought that this line was bad. It would be nice if you could do like a jump to. Is that a jump to? That's just set line. And to deep over. It'd be great if you could click a button, it just it jumps you to it. Like it, it just takes you to where it's at. I don't, I don't know where this guy is at. I assume he's somewhere over here in Des Moines, but I just don't know for sure where the pink line is. Reno finds an, uh, does an ore mine. Congratulations, Reno. Oh, it's this line. The line that comes all the way up over here to the top and then back down. The one that goes around everything. Apparently this thing just cannot make enough. Like it's, it's making as much as it possibly can. And the shipment is supposed to be 67 out of 400. I'm not quite sure why we're having a hard time shipping it to where it needs to go. The pliers. Shipping 70, shipping 68, shipping 62. Why does... Okay, explain this to me. Why does it say it's producing 400 and the shipment is only 664 out of 400? Like it's only making 64 out of 400? Why? Why is it only making 64 out of 400? Or is that saying like, hey, you're only moving 64 out of the 400? Because it looks like to me that that there's nothing, like there's not a gigantic stockpile of, of gravel here. You know what I'm saying? There's just not a humongous stockpile of it. And we're taking it and moving it as fast as it can make it. Right? So then it gets down here to this drop off. It all gets dropped off here. Is there any way to destroy that line? Manage the line. Yeah, done. Brick, drop off seven. Stone to brick, stone to brick. And then I called it rock to brick, which I could, I should have called it stone to brick. But all of those are bringing it to brick and then brick to drop off. So this thing makes it. It gets the shipment. It's consumed and it's stored. And then 42 gets all of it. It just doesn't sound right. Is it a two to one ratio? No, it's a one to one ratio. I don't understand this. Maybe you guys can help me. Um, I, it says it's producing 400, but I'm only shipping 63, but there's nothing, it's, there's nothing here that's being left over. You know what I'm saying? My guy, you guys are so old at this point. 
right? There's nothing here. Like there's no great stockpile of it. So I am moving as much as it's producing as fast as it can produce it. I get it down here to this thing and it shows up in here as like just a measly sum, like just an absolute measly amount of, 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 of stone shows up here. Uh, 117. You know, out of everything that we bring it, like 117, like it just doesn't seem like a lot, you know? Um, we have a lot of people driving on this road here. Are a lot of people going down to Reno? Houston Machines Factory. I don't need another Machines Factory. Maybe I do. Where's Houston? There's Houston. A machine factory was founded right there. And we make steel right there. Do we make planks nearby? Or can we make? We can. Look at that. We can make. Where, are you, where is all your wood going to? Jeez Louise. Look at that. I have 14 vehicles on this. Some of them are the big guys. And we're still just not taking care of business. I have a, I have a, I have a, a want. Let's upgrade all of them. Move the friggin... Move the friggin' uh, wood, please, and thank you. Well, see, that's what I'm saying. Like, this thing produces 400, and this thing says we're shipping 400. So this thing right here, like, we're gigging it. Like, we are making and producing as much as they, they say that we are. Like, I believe it when this thing tells me we're making 400. Right? Like, I believe that we're it's making 400 and we're shipping 400. The stone ones, for whatever reason, I do not believe the stone ones. I do not believe that the stone is producing 400, right? I do not believe that we are, we're shipping the 400. I don't know how to do it. Um, but anyway, Houston has that. Um, does anybody want machine parts in the South? Orange wants machine parts in the South. Des Moines wants machine parts and Reno wants machine parts. So, We need a new forest to feed that sawmill because this forest is feeding that sawmill. Oh, oh, look at that. There's two forests feeding that sawmill. Interesting. Interesting. Come on, give me another, give me an unused forest. There's an unused forest all the way up here. What if I built a highway? I mean, that's not that far away. This just caught my eye for a second. Hold on. 13 vehicles. And what's the problem here? Um, we could build a highway. Oh, good gracious. Look at that. There's a sawmill right there. And there's one, two, three. So it wouldn't be that big a deal. Bring these three into this sawmill and then use those planks and just send those planks directly down there. And then we already have steel being made there. So there's some of that steel. Yep, which we do have a lot of steel, right? Some of that steel can just be sent right over here to this place. And then those machine parts can be disseminated where they needed to be. Interesting, interesting. Let's do that. And let's start with a street, a little county road that goes through the mountain, just like right there. Okay, and then let's upgrade all these things so they can drive quickly um, and we'll have you do much okay there we go uh, and then go to buildings and then modular truck station would have been pretty sweet if we could just use one of these for both of those, but it is what it is. That and that. And 
than that. Now, where is a road depot? There's a road depot there. And then they can, they can get over there to it, yep. So, I'm just, gonna, I'm just gonna do the big boys from now on. Like, I don't know what else to do. Uh, I'm gonna do a new line. Uh, oops, hold on, stand by. Hold that thought, because we had to put a deal in for this. I need to do a street, and we need to upgrade that street there, and there, probably there, and there. Okay, now we can come over here. Now we can do a new line from there to there, and we're gonna call it truck, um, pound pound, and then just wood to plank. Now what was uh, purple? I think the purple was the other one that like I made one and then I and then I stopped. I was like, oh, I can't do this. I think it was I think it was line one. We we'll just we we'll just snag it right quick, and we're gonna go to uh, where is it? Where's line one? We're managed line at a station there to there okay and then come over here to these oh no what was the name of that place Worcestershire Road Department oh no there's no vehicle select oh they're already on oh, they're on they're already on line one right yep they're already on line one we just got to rename it so truck Pound, pound, wood to blank. There we go. And then last but not least, on to this, going to two, to a new line from there to there. Truck, pound, pound. Ah, wood to blank. I told myself that I probably should have just copied that, but I was like, no, I'll type it. It'll be fine. Okay. And then... Probably about five of these guys. Uh, new line from there to... Oh, whoops. Stand by. Let me build this. around right here and then we'll just oh it'd be nice if it was straight wouldn't it Something like that then click on the end of that and come straight this way to there perfect all right and then it has to be dropped off at the very end all the way down here Boop. All right. All right. And now that we have that, now we can go back to our road depot, which I think is that one. Yep. And then uh, it does that purple again, so that's good for me, but purple doesn't have. I got to manage the line first. Let me go here. Go here. Line one has the trucks, but I need to manage the line. I need to add a station from the Worcestershire branch down there whoopsie doodle For the houston branch i need to redo that as truck pound pound um plank to parts cool cool and then do another street go from there i want to tie it in over here uh ultimately it's going to be taking stuff i think out here anyway um, I don't know. The steel is coming over. That's right. The steel is coming over. And then the parts. Yeah, the parts are going to be dropped off over here in orange. Oh, orange has a parts thing. Okay. Cool. Cool. So, uh, we'll bring it into Des Moines then. So, we'll just bring this uh, out a little bitty baby bit. And then down to there. 
probably should have just taken it straight out like there. Um, let's do from the steel there over. So another road department. And I'll just take two. New line from there to there. And we'll just be borrowing some steel truck. Pound pound and then steel to oopsie doodle duty <laughs> feel the parts there we go uh and then my goodness gracious it never ever ends we'll pick up the parts there and we'll do that so probably three then a new line from there all the way into town down des moines and unloading them there and we'll call it truck uh des moines and then parts to drop off. Okie dokie. Woo. Goodness gracious. It's amazing how 18 wheelers just take over. You know, like they're just, they're not, I don't, I, don't, I guess they're efficient, but. Like they're just, they're the standard now, you know? It's hard to argue against them. Just look how many of them are coming out. There's more in there, probably three more. Wow, more than three more. <laughs> 300 more? Oh, there's the last one. Woo! Yep, they all have their roles to play. And most of those aren't going to be coming back this way. Most of those are just be running the wood back and forth. And once they make that right hand turn, they'll never come down here again. And then some of them will be running back and forth. So all the, the traffic we're seeing here isn't going to be always how it is here. Always so funny how they pull in when they when they first are, are made. You would think that the game would know like not to do that because obviously they were just made, but it, it does set the tempo, I guess. Slows things down a lot, though. The more I think about it, the more I'm, I'm pretty much convinced that those the grapple pits are bugged. Somehow, I think I'm 100% convinced at this point. First pickup of logs. Looks really good. And away we go. I can pick up of logs over here. That looks great. First couple of pickups over here. But what I'm saying is it just doesn't make any sense. Like, like this one guy right here should be producing 400 and we should be shipping 400. But for some reason, we're just not. And I'm not 100% sure why that is. Like, I'm not 100% sure why. Like, I, don't, I just don't know. It just doesn't make sense to me. I, I think maybe I did something wrong. Because I had the plane over here and the cargo container and all that stuff. And I just, I feel like we're not getting as much as we ought to be getting. Like we should be getting a ton of, of gravel over here. And we're just not. Like this, these, and it starts here with this place. This place is just not making enough. I do not know why. Uh, 
I'll have to Google it, I suppose. There's a lot of grain still not being moved. Is that grain or food? A lot of food not being moved. Is a train there? This one doesn't get overloaded, I don't think. I think this one can handle the amount of people that come in. Even though the train just like, I think it brings in like 50, but I think all these people can, can sit here no problem. Yeah. I don't think we have a problem here with overcrowding. All right, let's go check out on Pittsburgh. Let's go look at the, uh, there's a package problem here. Oh, not really. Let's go look at Pittsburgh. Let's go look at their, uh, look at, I knew that was going to happen. You have tons of people wanting to travel. Tons of people wanting to travel. Uh, did you just land? Ah, oh, I just caught it. Nice, nice, nice. Um, so this is that little intermediate one. Which is cool, which is cool. Let's see if we can't get the new 737-700. Who was the 747 before that? A 757. Next generation models compared to the classic series. It's quieter, more powerful. It can be used for transcontinental flights thanks to its longer range. 33. Loading speed of three, loading speed of 10. Mission, weight. Interesting. Um, I'll tell you what. We'll, we'll replace, we'll upgrade it to that. And we'll make, make four of those, just to see them. Just, just so that there's like a little bit of flavor. Instead of just, instead of just producing the absolute best one that there possibly is, We'll order a fleet of these guys just for fun. We're employing pirates. Pirates. Pilots. <laughs> Alright, buddy, load up. Get out of here. Takes him a second, doesn't it? Go. You have 33. This one has to unload and then pick up its people. Here, 82. Maybe it would have been a good idea to like make one of these the big one. Yeah, let's make one of these the big one. 757, 200. a little bit more of the backlog just to, just to pick up what's left all right and there's Pittsburgh oh we have a lot of things that need to be picked up over here really only two machine parts there's so many machine parts here Interesting. Let's change you guys out for the big reds. So those were the very first semi trailers we had. Oh my goodness, no, this is not going to work at all. 
There we go. Yep. Yep, 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 yep. This is not... Not kosher. There we go. And then let's see if we can't get... Um... We can get terminal number one. There we go. It's gonna get everything situated and make it look a little nicer. Bring in its steel. We got tools sitting here and we got parts sitting here. Who are the people coming to pick up these tools and parts? Hercules flying over there. That's cool. Cool to see that. You guys both pulling in here, it looks like so. You're dropping off 26 tools. Then you are picking up something. What are you picking up? You're grabbing those same tools he just dropped off. Nice. You got some steel you're bringing in. It's a very busy hub here. Interesting. You keep my eye on that. See if it works itself out now that we've upgraded all the the bigger uh, the bigger and better delivery trucks. Pick up a bunch of bread. There it is. You're doing bread too. Okay, we'll go ahead and convert you to the C. Only holds 20. Holds 54. Loading and unloading is 2. This holds 51. Loading and unloading is like 7. Oh, whoops. Oh, there it goes. I thought I messed it up because I, I clicked on it when it was trying to take off. It's good. Snag all the rest of that food. Looks like it. Great. What a nice game. What a nice world. I think we've really done some good work here. Really think we've done some good work. Go check in over here. A lot of logs not being picked up, but we kind of thought that would happen. Logs being dropped off here. They're not being processed. That's, that's that's interesting. Why are there logs being dropped off that are not being processed? That's funny. All the logs being dropped off here. Like all of the wood, the logs being dropped off here are going to go toward this to be, to be turned into planks. I don't know why they just dropped the logs off here, like for no reason. It's the purple line too that's doing it. Does it think that down here needs... Yeah, okay, let's manage this line. Look at that, more aircraft. Oh, we have a lot of cool stuff. Tank, a new tanker car, another deal. Some of this stuff now. Almost need to take a picture of that. Dang it. Okay, so the problem here is when you get down to the Houston branch, you're just going to be dropping off um, planks. That's all you're doing, man. You're just dropping off planks when you get down to the Houston branch. Okay. When you're at the Worcestershire branch, when you're up there, you're loading. 
loading the planes. And that's it. Hey, that's, it. that's all you're doing. That's all you're doing, my friend. Then down here, we're getting yelled at. We don't have enough room for everything. Who have thought? Now, what are you doing? You're bringing wood. Where are you bringing the wood to? The blue line. Where's the blue line taking that? The steel? Steel to parts? Why are you taking wood? And where are you taking it? Oh, dude. No, 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 no. I need to... And there's the line here. But you're in Houston transfer. All you're doing is loading steel. Really should start with things un, uh, everything unclicked. You're loading steel in Houston transfer. When you get to Houston branch, you're unloading steel. That should take care of itself, and the the wood should work itself free from that. I need to figure out where the parts people are at. Where are the parts people? Because the parts people need to need to step up their game, and the plank people, like the planks, need to be put over here too. Like I don't know what I'm going to do about that. Like the planks aren't going into here. Hope it'll work itself out. Have they made their first... Yeah, these guys. That's the drop off, yep. Yeah. We'll take three more of those, because there's just a lot of parts over here. And they need to be picked up. He's bringing, he's not bringing anything down. And there should be tons of planks up here to be brought down. Are you bringing any planks down? He's bringing no planks down. Why are they not bringing down any planks from now on? your branch load unload oh no it's pretty straightforward to me I guess because it's going to two different places. I guess because some of it's going to Des Moines. Some of it's going to the steel place. I guess they're all screwed up. And they're trying to like they're trying to balance out everything. They don't need to balance out everything. I have no idea what they're doing. There's some steel. And that steel is now being used to make Parts. Do I need to do I need to talk to your line too? Alright, talk to your line. The Houston branch, you're just oh uh, yeah, unloading the steel, that's it. You brought me some planks? Cool. Alright, well maybe that fixed it then. Maybe they'll work themselves out now. This is planks to parts. He took no planks and there are planks here. Twenty-two planks to parts. Terminal number one. 
Drum roll number one. Chopping off wood. Chopping off wood. This is a planks to parts guy, so he should be picking up a ton of planks. Let's see what he does. There you go. He's picking up tons of planks. Hey, okay, cool. This guy has the opportunity to pick up some planks. He's doing planks to parts. But he doesn't. He picks up none. Why? The whole line should be participating in this. So why aren't you picking up any planks, man? Same thing with you. test the other two when they come up here and see what they do. We'll, we'll make copies of that one because that one's doing what it's supposed to, right? So I'll make copies of it. We'll see what this one can do. Oh, this, one, this one's bringing in logs. That one's bringing in logs. Okay, this one's bringing in logs. Oh, 30 out of 30 on this one. Nice. That's a lot of... That's a lot of uh, planks right there. That's 15. These guys are coming back north. Or maybe those are the clones. I feel like those are the clones. That guy, I don't feel like it's going to do what he's supposed to do when he gets up here. We'll see, though. We'll see, though. I do like how the wood is like disappearing. This guy's supposed to be doing planks to parts. And he didn't. So he's gone. This guy. Again, planks to parts. this guy does wow interesting not a hundred percent sure why they just won't pick up those planks that are supposed to be there like not sure why that's a problem We'll go see it. We'll go look at Seattle when we get done with this. Let's just see if this guy will pick up. Yeah, he picks up some. Cool. Let me get a copy of him. Let me get two copies of him. He seems to know what he's doing. All right. Let's go look at Seattle. Hello, little Seattle that we have kind of ignored an awful lot. How are you doing? Hey, there's 70 people here who want to go on a plane ride. Nice. It takes him a second to unload everybody. And the big guy is going to roll up here. He's going to clean them all out. All those people there. He's going to say, come with me if you want to leave. 
boom, boom, boom. These people. Now, you just missed your flight, folks. The door is closed. So cool. So cool. I guess we could have done a bus. Ooh, 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 ooh. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Or I forget. There was a bunch of neat things, like a bunch of new neat things. Where's the train at down here? We have a new passenger train. Yeah. Where's the new passenger train at? The Speed Lane. Speed Dance Express. So this right here. And there's that vehicle. Edit it. That bad boy on it. And how fast does this thing go? 240 kilometers. And what do we have on the front of this? We got the old chug a lug. I had that toy when I was a kid. I had that guy. He's not even on the list anymore. He is so obsolete. Rip. So if we remove that, that section, that section, it's just this. It can hold 102. But how do you hold, how do you like add like one more of these? Like that? And that holds 200. And can you just, can you just, can you do that? Is that what I'm seeing? It, it just goes like that. And it's just faster, right? Like that's the big thing is it's just faster. It holds 204 people. Let's see how fast we can go. Let's see if we can get to 240. A little bullet train here. Are we in the 90s? Wow, those people didn't make it on time or something? I don't know what happened. Okay, we're at 80. There's a hundred. One twenty. Fifty. Wow, okay, all right. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. It would be cool if it would tell us, like, you know, hey, you reached a new speed limit. Can we get to 200? Nope. Didn't get to 200 before we got here. But we got out here super fast, though. Got out here super quick. That's cool. I like it. What's it say? Oh, the length of the train exceeds the platform length. So if we would extend the platform out, it wouldn't be that big a problem. Okay, understood. I don't think we're going to uh, passenger buildings, platforms. Do that, but then you can't because it's going to hit the road. Uh, I wonder if I can make the road just go down right there. Hold on one second. Go here and then do a small road. Let's build it. And then that's up. Too much slope. Collision. Okay, hold on. So do this again to here. And collision, collision, collision. There we go. And there we go. And now we don't have that problem because, uh, you know, we figured it out. There's also that. What is the other thing you can do? Is it this thing? Did I do any? I didn't do any of the vaulted sections. Do a vaulted section. There we go. Look at that makeover. Makeover. I love it. Ah, 
da 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 Same thing going on over here. We're gonna stop because they're so long. Let that get out of the way here. Let the traffic flow. Let the auto save complete. I gotta stop playing this. I gotta stop. It's so fun. It gets so addicted to fixing everything and making it look nice. Don't turn right. Fine. Come on, everybody. Let's go. I don't want your deaths on my conscience. Thank you so much. Hey. Okay. Go for that one guy. Okay. I don't think it needs to go down that way. It does. Alright, that gets us over. Or that gets us underneath the whatever. Uh, bring that out. And then... Oh, beautiful. Look at that. I love that. There we go. What's this? Is it a tram? Do we have any new tram? Oh, we do. The Cobra. 45. Loading speed of times 5. That's so friggin' amazing. These are tram lines. These are trams. Uh, some of these are buses. Um, so this holds 20, that holds 25, that holds 45. Boom. And hopefully we can do this and we can get rid of some of the buses and we can get rid of some of the redundancy. Like we don't need to have a million of them. Just imagine if this is how the government worked. Or something new was invented that was just better and the government just spent the money like the insane amount of money it raises through taxes just to fix everything and just everyone's life was made better constantly and you weren't really pissed because like so and so got like oh san francisco got brand new trams and you're like that sucks man like they got brand new trams what are we gonna get like because you always got something like the government always was like oh you get um you know better beaches like you get beach access where you don't have to like go and rent a hotel like you get to go change and, and there's like pools and stuff next to the beach and you're like oh that's awesome like it's great for tourists but i live there so i get to use it all the time oh i guess i could have just done that and just done all of those but that's cool all right let's see if where where's one of these new trams at oh there it is how friggin cute how friggin cute Let's see, let's go to a place that we know he has like a huge tram problem. Feels like all of them got fixed. Who was the worst offender? There's like some place where the trams are just so bad. I can't remember. The trams are cute though. That's amazing. I love that. And we also had we had new uh new airplanes too. But we have a new uh, train down here running around. We have new airplanes we need to be looking at. This right here, we have to do the platforms and extend the passenger platform. Look at that. We can just keep building it. It's so funny. Can't do it. We have to do it on this one now. Passenger platform, passenger platform. Can't do it here for some reason. It's odd. I'm not allowed to do it over here. Those are some, for some, oh, well, maybe because the track is in the way. Yeah, the track bends around on it for some reason. Or for, that's why I can't do it. Now, is that the fastest track we have? 
think so. Yeah. He's not going to get up to like the 200s or whatever here just because it's so... It's not. It's, it's too windy. Oh god, I gotta stop playing. Alright. Hey, thank you everybody for watching. Have a great day. I will see you in the next one. Bye-bye.